It's the Infinite Armbar with Justin Edwards. Hey, I'm Justin. This is Dean. We're here with Guard Defense Solutions, and today we're going to work on an infinite armbar drill. So, essentially, what I like every submission I have, I like to have a backup submission, and, and this is something we can do um, as a warm-up drill and get get used to it, and, and you can also get better at it. Uh, essentially, what we're going to do is is a solid armbar, and there's a, there's a ton of different like setups for your, for armbars, but we're just going to go for a real basic one. Uh, we'll start with that first one. I'm going to secure a wrist. I'm going to designate this arm the one I'm going to armbar. So secure it here, I come over the top, I grab right behind the tricep, right behind the elbow, that way if he pulls back, if he pulls his arm back, I have a catch there. And, and thirdly, I'm gonna open, open my guard, I keep my, my knees tied to his body, and my foot comes right to his hip. Now I have three things locking his arm into place. So if he tries to pull it out, it's gonna be very difficult for him to do. Uh, the next step, I'm, I'm gonna kick my calf up towards his head, and I'm gonna push with that foot that's already on the hip, to, to push my hips perpendicular to his body. This way, I'm keeping everything tight. I come up, I squeeze my knees, and I can finish arm bar here, but sometimes you get in this situation, the guy's slippery, uh, he's sweaty, and he, he can just pull his arm out. And then I, I want a, a second option or a backup option if this happens, because I don't want to be screwed and just lose my position. All I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hand and go over the top and grab the tricep on the other side, put my foot in the other hip, and then push my hip sideways, and as, as this happens, I'm going to drop my knee to the mat and hook my foot and pull his head down. If, now, if you notice when I do this, his head and posture comes down. This is going to keep, lock the arm bar into position. Because if this is not, not flexed or he postures back up, going to posture up, I'm going to lose it. So this is my safeguard that's going to hold me into place. And once I set my hips to the side, I come back over, I hook the head, knees pinch. I can finish arm bar here, same position. If he goes to pull, pull this arm out, I can just come back across the other side, foot in the hip, come back around, I lock his head, come back, armbar this side. So, so then he pulls it out, same thing, and just keep coming back around and around. And this really, it really uh, lets your hips open up and flow back and forth and go from armbar to armbar. So, so I'm not just stuck, I'm not just stuck in the one armbar if I don't get it, I'm not a one trick pony. So if I'm here, he pulls it, I come across, come back around, and boom, here, pull, cross, boom, here, again. And every time I do this, my knee, I pull the mat, I flex my foot to catch the back of his head, it comes down, and here. And every time I finish, my knees are tight, and if I want to finish, I just extend. So it's a really fun drill. Um, for, if you just have one partner, just go, kind of go back and forth and get warm. Um, it'll really tighten up your arm bar and give you a second option if you miss that first one. Beautiful. Uh, for more from Fast Eddie Justin Edwards, like this video, subscribe to our channel, and plenty more content coming your way.